I'd like to thank you for meeting us in person. I know we're all, especially my client, um, eager to get this settled. Especially the client. Before we get to the details, we have revised our figures. We are ready to close this book and move on if Lord Pierce Walker can agree to 10 million. Excuse me? Jason. Now, that is a substantial drop from our last number, more than half. And this is really about LPW meeting us halfway. We are also willing to bend a bit on the payment structure. Pauline, I I'm sorry, I'm, I'm gonna have to cut you off. It's only to spare us the extra energy. This is starting to get comical. Comical? Please, Jason. No, hold on, what, what about my situation that's comical? That I was injected with millions of tiny frickin' machines? And then I can barely lift my arms and legs. Or and then my chest almost collapsed. Sorry about your condition, but you signed forms, Mr. O'Brien. They do not the dangers and what to be entitled to. That won't even get me through the decade. I can't work anymore. Work. Does LPW want this getting out? I would treat it What he means is that he is very active online, and if this went to court, we would it's have. It's not going to court. His blog has a little over. 2,000 visitors a month. That's hardly dangerous, Jason. We could drag this on forever. $500,000 is our final offer. I'm sorry. Don't mean to waste your time. Jason, that wasn't the plan. Nobody deserves this. Those nanites destroyed my body. Your company sits on billions because of people like me. But if we get sick... You're a guinea pig, Jason. So is your name for yourselves. I had a purpose. I helped them. Let me guess. Your life, prior to this unfortunate accident, went something like this. Two weeks in a lab. Your blood swimming with a mixture of poison you knew nothing. Days spent eating, tweeting, sleeping, planning your next vacation, so that when the job, if you really want to call it that, was done, you'd cash out and fly out to Waikiki or the Bahamas, sip some pina coladas and work on your tan. Wait two months until the medicine dribbles out of your pores, just long enough to pass the screening of another test somewhere around the world. And then you do it again and again and again. Never worry that something might go wrong. Who would you? You're a lab animal. I'm not a cliche, Mr. O'Brien. I'm looking after my client's best interest, sure. But on a personal level, I just don't like your type. So I have very little sympathy. And what I do have lives in the settlement. And maybe in this advice, go back in, tell your counsel you'll accept, and then use that money to build yourself back up. Okay?